Greetings from Chirac, Illinois. Armored cars safely transported both teams to Mercenary Field today, shielding them from a flurry of gunfire and the infamous Polish grandma gang's bombardment of sausages, hot dogs, and pizzas. What a way to get ready for kickoff. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Snuffle Thrills take on the Midway Mutants. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hi again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with the only guy to ever get cut from the league for testing positive for not taking enough steroids or mutant growth hormones, Brickhead Mulligan. Hey, there was a reason for that. I had to quit taking steroids. My nutsack was shrinking. When I sprouted this mini-me on my shoulder, Bricks Jr. beat me out. You're a pussy. And it's first and ten. the way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all about momentum and killing and it's first and ten say what come on man you can't hang with me you get my grill i'm gonna ruin your world you understand me Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And that'll bring up third down and seven. First down! Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? Second down and ten. Well, that play didn't work. We'll have to rethink that. Third down and nine. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Any field goals over 40 yards are difficult. He's going to really have to boom this one. murder and bribery are cheered it's good to be good huh i mean can we all just not this shit again bricks i'm stopping it right there and that's a returnable ball returnable you mean he can get a refund for it no no bricks it, it means he can return it for you know what Never if that hit didn't cripple him it certainly left skid marks <laughs> Second down and a lot. The defender says, I don't think so. Third down and the punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two. And the ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Some things like that in a quarterback. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. If there were any 
functioning brain cells before that hit. They're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You got to keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You got to make that catch. Second down and ten. They're taking what the defense has given them. That's a four-yard gain on the reception. Hey, less than a wipe for the headache. Third down and six. <laughs> now, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he put all of his foot into that one. The return man catches the ball and heads up field. Boom! And it's first and ten. Not, not one. Hey, man. I scared one of Shiva. I am a hell of a fellow. Second down in a mile. Great chance for a big game. But still not enough for a first. Even I'm frustrated, and I'm a team agnostic. Third and four. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. Six-yard game there. That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do solid pickups more often. I step in bunk turns on my front porch every day. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot three. It's a touchdown! Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Second down in a very long. And 
it's first and ten. Showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. Not, not one. on that pass play. Second down and five. Hot one, hot two. Gets the ball, get the first down and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Second there. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting or dead. Third down and never going to happen. <laughs> Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he got an off. That's a decent punt. Nice catch. And he turns on the afterburner. Pump for three pow. And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And they'll line up for the punt here. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Eight. 
First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. Second down and a lot. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Nicely done for a first down. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. And it's first and ten. Hot one. And he held on to that one for a first down. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Wow, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot, hot. And he's running like a moose right now. He breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Yay. <laughs> Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. Eh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the line, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. with the brain scrambler. <laughs> the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Not we all win. Not we all. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. They stumped the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work breaks. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Satan Industries eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, throw in the half. Can you pick me up a soylent beer? The teams come out of halftime all tied up and ready to battle it out. Oh, jeez, Grim. I hope someone ties them soon. They gotta play football. <laughs> Second down and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Third down and three. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot, hot, hot. First down. I see this guy trying. 
drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And it's first and ten. multiple times on each occasion not surprising and trust me that hit was worse and that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play and that'll bring up second and one but he just ran into the line at the dmv and guess what Grim? Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. And that'll bring up third and one. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. I don't know if he even had a target on that throw.
Third down and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one time thing. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. We're tied up at the end of the third quarter. You can smell the excitement on the fans. I mean, literally, it is ripe in here. Man. Junior, was that you? Hey, blow me. Hot. Hot one, hot two. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? They kicked the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Oh, nice hit! <laughs> Check 
Cracker Town the size of Brick Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stop burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Second down and nine. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Third down and long. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross pitching, unbelievable. And he's got a chance for a good return here. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Hey, man, nobody can touch you with that ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? Uh Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Oh, he just got crushed. <laughs> Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Man, what a hit that was. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Hey, man, I was hanging on the kettle now. You know what happened? Second down and long. Hot one. Hot two. Hot Picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. It's the two-minute warning. You know what that means, right, Bricks? Yeah. Take a giant whiz and get in a fight in the men's room. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. 
Or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores... Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. Oh, 
with the brutal hit. First down and six. Second and eight to go. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Third down and eight. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self -dying. But he seems to have worked through it. Yeah, you see that, little lady? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> the mutants walk away defeated. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. Yeah, that was beautiful. <laughs> With Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every other.